In this video, we'll write the formula for dinitrogen tetrafluoride. This is also called tetrafluorohydrazine, and it's a very reactive gas. When it's in the presence of organic substances like paper, wood, you, it explodes. So pretty dangerous stuff, very strong oxidizer. To write the formula for the dinitrogen tetrafluoride, when we see these prefixes here, we know that we have a covalent, also called molecular compound, and we use the prefixes to write the formula. So we have nitrogen, so we'll write N, and that di, di means two, so we have two nitrogen atoms. Fluoride, that's from fluorine, so we write F, and that tetra there, tetra is four, so we have four fluorine atoms. And the formula for dinitrogen tetrafluoride is N2F4. If you were given the formula and asked to write the name for N2F4, you need to recognize that nitrogen and fluorine are both nonmetals. Since they're nonmetals, it's a molecular compound and you need to use these prefixes here to tell the number of atoms. This is Dr. B with the formula for dinitrogen tetrafluoride, also called tetrafluorohydrazine. Thanks for watching.